the Uniondale Hitchhiker Uniondale, Eastern Cape. This is probably one of the most famous, and one of the saddest ghost stories. Between Uniondale and Willowmore, in the semi-desert area of the crew there is a very well-known story about a phantom hitchhiking girl. On 12th of April 1968 there was a car accident on the N9 road to Willowmore, near the town of Uniondale. The car, a Volkswagen Beetle, was occupied by a young off-duty Air Force lieutenant and his fianchi. It was a bitterly cold, stormy night. The girl was asleep on the back seat of the car when the accident occurred. They were on their way to tell their respective families of their recent engagement. Maria Rue was tragically killed in the accident and since then, a female hitchhiker has appeared at exactly the same spot several times. In 1978, a motorcyclist gave a lift to a girl who suddenly disappeared while they were riding at full speed. He said that he knew immediately she had gone because the change in weight distribution caused the bike to swerve. On Good Friday, 1976 Anton Lagrange from Mount Shorten was driving from Willowmore and was roughly 13 kilometers from Uniondale when he saw a woman standing by the roadside. She was short with brown hair and wore dark trousers and a jacket. It was around 7.15 p.m. and it was getting cold, so Anton stopped his car and she got in the back seat. As he continued toward Uniondale he tried to talk to the girl but she would not reply. It is only when he looked into the back seat that he realized that she was no longer in the car. There have been many reports of people picking up a mysterious young girl on the side of the road, some hear her laugh. Some hear her scream. And then she is gone. Her ghost is the cause of fear and apprehension amongst locals passing through Union Day lat night.